What have we got? Opa! Opa Dopa. What do we want to do? What do we want, team? I, I did say I wanted to play Delhi before. <coughs> yeah, I think I think HRE's strength is as they enter late game. I think their weakness is late late game. Because I think the units just are bad. I do, I do, I do. Today is my cooking day today, team. My cooking day. I don't know what I'm going to cook yet, but your Benny B be cooking. All right, boys, let's see what we can do here. I'm actually very, very tempted to play some uh, some Doom of Faith here, even though that's probably a little bit crazy. A little bit crazy. But still, but still, I feel it in my fingers. I feel it in my toes. You can't attend a barbecue without becoming the chef? Really? Is that because you like doing it? Do Abbas and Ayabid feel different? Yes, definitely. Definitely do. I think Ayabid is stronger, but Abbasid isn't bad. Yeah, I know when we've done barbecue here, and it's been like just uh, my like immediate fam. In fact, even when I was younger, I used to do fucking barbecue for my family, like back in England. That was funny. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go doing my faith. I do. I think I prefer Abbasid just because they're more macro orientated, whereas Ayavid is far more uh, tempo orientated. Why Dome of Faith? I'm thinking that Tower of Victory kind of feels like I want to play more investing into a feudal game. And against English, I'm not sure that's what I want. I also think I kind of want to go for a slightly faster tech. Yeah, I'm, I'm very interested in what he's going to go, like if he's going Abbey or what have you. So I'll probably run straight up to his base now. Oopsie daisy. She took my heart and she took my money. It's that time of day where I get Ricky Martin stuck in my head. <laughs> Some good old Ricky Martin, boys. Alright, here's the Abbey. Here's the Abbey. Yeah, I, I don't know what happens to me. It's just some Ricky Martin comes on, you know. I'm like, fuck yeah. What changed for English? Now your Abia Kings freely spawns a king. It's great. It's a cool change. Uh, let's do it like this. 
So I will need quite a fast stable or barracks here to deal with uh, the mad lad. Mad lad himself. And I think I'm going to opt for... I'm going to opt for a... Uh, for a stable this game. Still in production. Okay, it still works. She makes you take your clothes off and go dancing in the rain. Oh, to live a Billy Zane life is to take away his pain. Like a bullet through his brain. Come on, upside, inside out. Living la vida loca. Hooray, boo you down, living la vida loca. Living la vida loca, living la vida loca. Hey, okay, we'll get out of that. Oh, well, hello. One thing you gotta know about Gazi he bros. They're pretty strong, my Gazi he bros. Gazi bros, my Gazi bros. They're pretty strong, they're my Gazi bros. Gazi bros. They're my Gazi bros. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you motherfucker. You e fucker. I tell you. I tell you. Oh, 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 
So I've almost got all my blacksmith upgrades, which is quite amazing. Quite amazing. What does he have? No upgrades yet, that I can see. So, I mean, that's also quite cool. And I'll tell you what, we're about to hit uh, age up potential here. And he's got, he's got a good army. He's got a good army. Enough to be a bit respectful. And I'll tell you what, let's get a house of learning. Do they have spearmen? Not yet, no. Very interesting party. I'll wait till I get a few more knights here. Uh, better Ghazi riders as well, which is definitely cool. We just killed a king. Interesting game. Interesting game against Wham here. Tips on base building with Delhi. I don't. I don't think that's something you have to worry about too much. Overall, is what I would say. Worth time stamping. De I can definitely do it. Like uh, Delhi, the Delhi Dome of Faith build. 